Greetings and salutations. I am Castellan of Ingmar and all, and welcome back to the RR Dunayam campaign. It's been a while since we've actually touched the campaign. Uh, well, I mean, the first one uh, pretty much died. Um, so, let's uh, start. Uh, supposed to be recorded earlier today is uh, re uh, updated in the process as well. Not to the new patch that I'm planning, the that will come later. It's a mi very minor thing, so I highly doubt people will notice. Uh, our Gimophon and whatever their faces are, I literally can't remember his name. Our Gim our Gimokad. Uh, Ambar. I am on my very, very loud uh, chair. It's a very loud chair. And um, I don't really see any of this. For some reason, my lord. when I. Ships ready! When I was testing, yes, or, well, when I wanted to start the campaign, the into the it would crash between Isengard and Angmar. So yes. I had to scrap the entire build, and it took me a while Holding to get this ships, one up. My lord. As you can tell, we have, um, I always forget the guy's name, but uh, I have the new menu uh, loading screen. Uh, well, the new menus and uh, icons by, uh, I always forget his name, I, I'll probably put a link in the description. Fine day to sail. We can go no further. And we can go very no nice. further. We can Special go no love. further. Uh, I'm just trying to We can go no it. further. We can go no further. Okay, that's we as far as we're no going to go. So, I'm not going to be your orders about without question um, or no one's tomorrow's going to journey yet. planned out my concern is these two settlements it's going to take a while so I have played Umbar several times well not Umbar anymore the RR Dunayam several, several times um, but I haven't played it recently especially Divide and Conquer since I've been playing a lot of 12-12 especially their uh Alpha campaign. I am one of their uh, testers, so it's kind of my priority. Since I am, you know, a test. I just repeated myself. There's a little me saying it. So, um, yeah. Very good campaign so far. I really like it. It's, um,. Very, uh, ready. it's somewhat challenging. Uh, in fact, I Taking think it's uh, challenging your if you're going to try and play as um, any of the German uh, factions or just anyone involved in the Holy Roman Empire. It's very hard to build momentum because your main concern is not to piss off the Holy Roman Empire. Um, I was the last one I tested was the Elector. Um, and if there, if you guys are hearing noise, that's literally just my chair. I am leaning on it, and it makes a lot of noise. Um, so that look. Awfully suspicious. I would not trust a woman who stared at me like that. We shall uh, engage. Yeah. We shall prevail. We're most definitely just gonna siege this out. We're yes. not gonna risk it. Um. Interesting thing about Turkey and the 
early game is um, well right now uh, 1100s uh, technically 13th century um, because centuries are usually a number ahead than what they actually are um, so I find it very interesting yes my lord that some of the units that you get for uh, Trier are not units under the name Trier but electorate units I actually find that very interesting that those are the electorate units are your main line early game well during this that short period the 1100s to 1200s it's uh, very interesting this chair is so noisy ships ready ships yes over. sir full sails um, yes my lord yes how many turns are going to be here for a while? So, I find it very interesting. I, um, and for a long period of time in that case, I was building up money and just conquering minor uh, factions in the Holy Roman Empire. Uh, I think the first one I got rid of was, how was it called? I think they were. I think I got rid of them first, and then I went for. I think it was. Your orders, my. It wasn't the Swiss. It was someone else. Um, I went for the French. Yeah, that's who I went after them. After which I didn't. Ready. Very um. A fine day to sail. I thought it was really funny. Yes, sir. Full sail. And. Yes, my lord. I have, um... As you come on, yes. A relatively, um... Good re I have a really I strong don't. relation with the Holy Roman Empire. Um... They don't... Uh, minor factions? Uh, I'm currently at war with the Swiss, I believe, in that can um I've been, it's been essentially war of attrition at this point I think I I haven't touched in a while uh, because of your orders my lord m my uh courses in uh the university well at the campus uh that I live nearby I've been busy with all those assignments so I haven't played it recently Adding this to the schedule isn't actually all that hard, all that bad, in all honesty. Is it just one day out of, just like one or two hours out of my day, just to, and so long as I upload one in the week, I'll be fine. And it's not, not that concerning, really. Mission failed. Haradrim. I... Didn't even bother checking. Didn't I? I'm gonna save real quick. Uh, uh, I am. One. So we will be at turn, I believe, 12 or 13. And by the time the city of Umbar Falls, and I'm gonna keep a reasonably sized garrison to keep the peace and send my sons to take the northern settlements. Um, I wanna have a good foothold in the north, um, because the Haradrim are gonna have a hard time getting over here. It takes a lot of time, and they don't really have a whole lot of settlements over here or especially down here. Um, and yes, my lord. I don't know. The next week's video will be focused on... My lord. Uh, what's it called again? 
will be uh, Your orders. strictly the without uh, question tutorial videos. It will be Your orders, uh, my lord. Yeah, it will be turned from. It's going to be focused on unit models uh, or unit textures, kind of, but more on the textures. But we won't be editing models or textures that much. Um, it's going to be about all the directories that go into that. Um, I will show you guys how to do a converter I use. Um, I would have to find it first, which is going to make that video a little later in the week. So I have to find it. You can, you can find it on the Total War Center. I believe it was made by another uh, model there. Um, it's a pretty good converter. Um, problem is, I have no idea how to get um, bow animations to work properly. Um, so I'll have to figure that out at some point, but for now it's not a major concern. Um, I am the only person who works on this mod, um, on the sub mod, so I can't really learn everything. And pretty low. Man. My lord. Um, so yeah, something I find very interesting is, um, uh, how the Numa, well, how Numenorian technology, um, more in the films than the books, because in the films, they almost like, 11th triumphed. century grades. Our courage and honor have um, conquered. They get to that level of uh, armor. It's predominantly male that we see. Um, that's kind of the basis of the armor. Um, and it's, it's always really the basis of all armor in the West. Um, and what I mean by the West, I mean anything, it's a more, my definition is more of a diagonal line, anything that's south of Kiev, or what would be Republic of Novogrov, and uh, uh, to maybe around um, where to the end of uh, the Arabian Peninsula and that's where male was the most common um, and most widely used of the armors an order uh, orders your will my lord orders my lord five archers orders my lord. Two halberds. Orders. Your will, Three my lord. Spears. And we will go north. Finish them! What we have here. We will lower the tax rate. Get our uh, economy boosting. We are losing a lot of money. Repair. And we will. What do we want? Dark Sanctuary, we want culture. What is our culture right now? There's a wrong one. Um, no, this one. Um, we have 24%. So we want a shrine. Pretty expensive. 
Where's the patient hall? We can get that. We're gonna get it. I I'd rather spend less money. Yes. In all honesty. This is a total of what? That's five. Five. This is eleven units. What do they have here? Okay. That's um eight. We outnumber them. Moving to crush the enemy. So we're gonna end turn. And So, so back to progression of armor in the films. What would have the Numenorians wore? Because this is a good thousand years, two or three thousand years before Gondorians start wearing plates um, in their armor. It's a very... Uh, Interesting. Um, just how they um, finish them. Besieging the coward. I guess how Lord. slow are they? not going the, anywhere. Uh, was yes, my lord. How yes. technology progressed. It was pretty slow. It would have been pretty slow. Um, Fine with yes. this. Yes, you will. How much are we making? Mm, not that much. I'm losing some money. My lord. You are 216. My lord. You. I can't see what you, how much you cost. I'm sending you there. Unless. Um, yeah. Your will, my lord. By your this command. is fine. Orders. Actually, this is a bad, stupid idea. We'll make camp out. here. Your will, um, my lord. Yeah. So here we are. My lord. So I highly doubt they're actually not. Uh, Sally out. They're outnumbered by three units, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, they're outnumbered by three units. Why was I having a hard time doing math? I'll never know. Um, so, back to the topic. I keep getting off of it. So, my, in my head, the Numenorians had to have, like, something we would have seen in, like, classical Greece, like, their l linen uh, cuirass. We would have to see that, potentially, March from the Numenorians, very uh, Greek cop light. An order. Um... Not super um, lavish or in general not very expensive relatively compared to other uh, forms of armor. I mean, linen um, is expensive. It can be. It can be expensive, but I mean. It's agricultural. It's an agricultural resource, and gambeson was pretty widespread in Europe. And from history, gambesons were pretty much armor, and the Greeks were able to think that 
the way the Greeks used linen was very interesting. Um, in the way they kind of made the earliest form of fiber materials or hardened fiber products. Um, what I mean by this is like products like carbon fiber. Um, the cuirasses they used looked somewhat were kind of made in a similar way to that how you would make uh, carbon fiber sheets or um, carbon fiber um, tubes or billets they would boil um, hide to get, make a glue it's a uh, uh, way to get glue. You can boil animals' hide, use the fat and cartilage in skin to make glue, and it's very strong. Um, linen uh, and brush um, that glue on top of it, and then put a sandwich it, uh, the glue between linen, and you make as many layers as you can, and you would have a very durable armor. Think of it as early um, Kevlar, because that's yes. kind of what Kevlar is, it's a woven material um, stuck together, um, but not in the sense of glue holding it all together. Um, of course it wasn't like, it's not like plate, it's not as hard but it's a lot lighter and more, a lot more breathable. Um, and it's really smart. You don't really see this kind of stuff in today, uh, where we protective gear out of woven materials and making it carbon fiber um, or fiberglass. Those materials are very sturdy, and the real vulnerability would be uh, flammability. Uh, the adhesives are usually very flammable. An and order. Unlike materials that would be made with those kind of uh, products made with fabrics, carbon fiber doesn't burn. And I can confirm this because I have worked with carbon fiber before in a little pet project. Um, and it was very um, good in hindsight, really. Uh, I want to do something about this. Hmm. It's very expensive. This is gonna be a big thing in the in this entire playthrough. I'm gonna be a, a cheapskate. I'm I'm trying to save money. We're losing money, and I don't want to lose a whole lot. My lord. Um, but I mean, we need to expand quickly before we can really do anything because we don't to have as many assets as we can to get money to essentially balance out. Um, so I, I do think um, the Numenorians would have had something like the linen composite materials like the Greeks would have had um, in later periods, to an, a certain extent early periods, but such it wasn't, is the fate of uh, all that who oppose us. The settlement has fallen. We'll Take the spoils of war. I'd rather war. not deal with a massive um, uh, problem. I'd rather not deal with it so much. So we only have a percent here. How much do you cost? Uh, expensive. Fine. The 
solution. That's gonna be a problem, but it's not that big of a problem, I think. Yes. It's gonna prove me wrong. Your will, it? my lord. Uh, we need we need another settlement. I am tempted to take Gobel Mithlon Mirlon. I'm very tempted to take it. Because if we don't take it, we're not gonna have Orders. the Your will, my ability lord. to Orders. really um Moving to crush the enemy! Send him there. Yes. We'll make camp here. Or don't. Orders. March to oh, exhaustion. Continuing later. Me. An order. We shall slaughter them. Your will, my lord. Oh, uh, do we we'll have any missions here. I haven't checked? Isn't worth it. Your Not orders. really. Impossible. We can check Without or question. try. I don't care. We're gonna have a right, yep. There we go. We're gonna lose some men, and we can't really replenish them. Isn't that fun? Happy mistakes. Happy little mistakes. So, I'm gonna go until maybe uh, 30 minutes, maybe, probably. I don't know. Um, uh, I want this to be reasonably long. Oh god, I should have turned that off. How about... No. Yay! We lost 12 men. My lord. As you wish. That's nice. Thank you, game. I hate you. Don't you just love this game? I don't, I don't have the men really to spare. Um, is there anything damage? No. You are a bunch of, as I hear, raiders. I need to edit these. In the next patch, the major yes. patch. This is not worth it. As you command. At least not yet. Ships ready. Uh, we have their port blockaded. Blockade, please. Be gone. Come and get yeah, me, you not gonna deal with that yet. I don't have the men. It's not really worth it. So they are slightly better right now. I mean, it's a larger army. Arguably. So. We need to do some checking. Um, I highly doubt they're gonna send anyone. My lord, what as you wish. over here, isn't that nice? Yes. Good. Thank you. Approaching the there is something you wish to speak of. Let's trade. I, I don't accept. really want you as an ally. You want map information? I can I can offer you we map information. To hear you out but for map information, I you hate me. Uh, uh, no. No, I must declare no. you here. A shame, but your caution is not hate only welcome. Uh, words of wisdom such as these. I really do hate it. I don't like how. Uh, that needs to be a suspect. Um, here, construction here. Button. There we go. I don't want garbage. Actually, garbage is pretty useful. Let's send them to the front. We need bodies. That sounds wrong, but I don't care. I need souls to send to die um and i can't really afford um super expensive units like uh my abrunarzim units um too expensive uh, 
expensive, expensive, expensive. This, this is kind of refreshing in all honesty, playing uh, Divine and Conqueror again. Uh, I haven't played in a long time, and I really do enjoy it. I used to play it a lot, mostly because I couldn't play um, Attila or on my uh, old computer. Even though that computer was reasonably uh, tough for what it was, it could handle Rome too on very high settings. It was a bit of a monster for a computer that was like maybe seven inches long or so. Maybe like a foot long. Um, and like seven inches wide. It wasn't a very big computer, it was a travel computer. Which is how I started modding. Funny, isn't it? Yeah, go away, please. I do not want to deal with you, even though most of that army is made of trash. I'd rather not deal with it. I don't have. I can't cheese my way as easily, well, as much as I want to. Your orders. Uh, as you wish. My favorite way to play a campaign. Without question. Tomorrow's and journey like, planned out. In my opinion, out. the only way. Can't beat the KI in its own game. Cheese him. How much are we making? Not much. We're gonna need it. Anyways. Your will, my Boot. lord. As so, you wish. You're probably gonna all die. A horrible death. I don't care though. I need bodies. Gimme. I need my meat shields. Grain exchange, we need more trade. Can I boost this up? Yes. We are making more money. We're gonna die. It's 20 turns in. Not much has happened. <laughs> Isn't this campaign fun? Don't you just love Divide and Conquer sometimes? I do mean it. Um, like I said earlier, I do love Mon. Uh, Divide and Conquer in general is just amazing. And Attic here, Hummingbird, they're all great guys, and I admire them for still keeping this going. Um, it's, it's really amazing, in all honesty. It's kind of one of the things that got, got me into uh, gaming, really. Um, was the Total War franchise, especially Divine and Conquer. Divine and Conquer was the reason I got into modding. What's funny is, the first campaign I ever played when I bought Medieval 2 was not even the base game or the base mod. It was Divine and Conquer um, Elves of Enladris. I played it on very hard, very hard. For the first time, first time I played the game and I got pretty far uh, one of my f most one of the only victories that I still uh, wave and will never allow to die was uh, my victory against uh Ingmar, I was trying to hold a small settlement, and I have I have a screenshot on my Steam. Uh, I have the screenshot on Steam, and I posted in the uh, Devon and Conquer uh, screenshot thread my outrageous victory with only 600 elves facing off almost 4,000 orcs. Um, and it, I think it was version 0 
I, I got it in not that long ago into this game. I haven't, even though I've got so many hours into it because this is all I ever played. I hate, I hate seeing that. It bothers me so much. The number dropping. It hurts. Uh, it hurts. I don't like it. I don't like seeing the number drop. Orders. Yeah, what were we gonna do? Send him off. We can go no further today. How many bodies can I? Orders. The day is ours. We have conquered. We are making so many. As you wish. Just one more unit. Who am I willing to sacrifice? Who costs the most? Uh, you guys. My lord. Yeah, I guess so. Please do not cause your command. Can I send one more without it going to hell? Your will, my lord. Yes. Yes. There we go. We are making money at least. And money is money. And you guys can go to hell. The Harajim must burn. For they are heretics, and by the time I get the flamethrower units, I'm probably going to be in pain, in all honesty. Actually, maybe not. Probably. Yeah. I have no idea what direction, um, well, I mean, in terms of whether or not I'm going to side with good or evil. I'm probably not. Um... Probably pull some Orders. shenanigans. By your command, in honesty. we'll make camp here. Uh, that corruption is uh, going to be a problem. And I need the money. I need the money. Your um, will, my lord. You go north. Yes. We need the bodies. That's going to sound wrong. I mean, it already does sound wrong. Just saying we need the bodies. When am I, Russia? <laughs> Why did I even say that? Of course I'm Russia. In the file, for people who don't know, the R.R. Dunayim in the game files is Russia. So the answer is yes, I am Russia. Answer my own question. Like an idiot. Um, what's funny is when I first started playing this game, six hours, I could play for hours. Most fun I ever had with a game. I mean, the first Total War games I ever bought were Alexander and Rome 1. I played them for a while. Then played, um, the, uh, what's it called? Then I bought, uh, Yes, my lord. As you wish. Where I, yes. Where? Yes, my lord. Settlements down here, I'm an As idiot. you wish. Stopping here. Uh, where are you? You are over here. I am an idiot. I, was, I uh, shall continue tomorrow. Orders. By your Do command. I mean, no, I don't. Your will, my lord. As, As my you wish. My lord. Send the bodies. By your we need the bodies. Totally Orders. doesn't sound bad. We're sending you up. Continuing tomorrow. Probably would have been better to send you there, but who cares? Um, it's almost time for me to end this episode. Um, 
I'll go for till turn 25 and that will be the end of this episode. It's a very boring beginning. Um, but I mean, we haven't really... Well, I'm playing it safe, really, because it's very hard, very hard. And I usually haven't played a campaign or I haven't played two in a long while. I'll start from normal, then go to hard, then to whatever. Oh, how nice. AI, I hate you. You're gonna make this so much fun. My lord. So By your command. My lord. Why? This is a perfect position to ambush. Why? Orders. That's why. Uh What is there? Explain. Explain to me. Game. My lord. Okay, that makes complete and total sense. What are your traits? I didn't pay attention, did I? No, I didn't. Uh, just because he doesn't have respect, probably. I don't know. He doesn't have anything actually bad. So, An order. I'll be more comfortable sending him to die. Totally not evil. Totally. Not evil. I'm totally not evil, guys. Don't worry about it. It's not like I'm sending um, someone to die because um, I don't really care. It's actually because I don't care. He can die. I don't care about him. Man, you had a lot of girls. Okay, I don't care. Just pump those kids out, I guess. I'd rather not die from something stupid. Right. I forgot to do that. Aren't I smart? This is, uh... Oh, so calm. I have no idea what in this, in the last build, I really don't. I don't get how it didn't work. Oh. About no. I know it would be a good idea, but I can't afford him. They're expensive. My lord. And we just failed the mission. I should have done it. Eh, who cares? Approaching. What is it you wish Trade to with me. It's good Thank to you. see we could reach an agreement. Can I can uh very well. What else? I'd rather you not us you have hold to fight us at ransom because, and you uh, know another proposition you guys have for us there? Pikes and I only have halberds. This proposal okay, is of li fine. an honor and a pleasure. Farewell. Actually, I do have pikes, but I don't get them in the early game. They're a late unit, and they're super. They are an AOR too. I love. I should maybe take out the spearmen and replace them with pikemen. Mm -hmm. Make it a clear transition. Well, I mean, we have the hellbirds. I will only you address have? you in yes. battle. What's in this? I can't see. Got it. Okay. It's not a big army. But I don't like Come facing and hordes. Me, and these have javelins. 
Can they make the javelins AP? I will only address you in battle. Tell him that. Yeah, no, I didn't make it AP. So no real problem, I think. I can't get this settlement. The AI is gonna hold it. I could focus yes. on getting your will, my lord. You An order. A riot. So Moving to crush the enemy. We go. I've tried whipping them with the men of spent. There Nothing no shall escape your notice yet. in these lands, my lord. An order. Let's, uh, Finish them. Let's have order. this one, because yes. it's not gonna matter. Um, we have our trash protecting this place. Totally smart. One hundred percent smart. Foolproof plan. Nothing could go wrong. Nothing can possibly go wrong. Everything can go horribly wrong, actually. So, this is the last turn. So, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you guys want more of the RR Deny Him campaign, let me know. I. It's not like I do this as a job, it is literally my hobby. I don't know. The moment it turns into a job, I, I'll probably stop. Or am I can? It'll be probably actually it would be as a job. At least as a uh, change maker, pocket change maker. Um, since I'm in the medical field, getting a job won't be all that hard. Uh, yes. We shall slaughter them, my lord! We'll stop um, here. So yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, sometime next week. Bye.